गाइज माई नेम इज अंकुश कौरव एंड आई वेलकम यू टू कॉन टू सीरीज इन दिस सीरीज ऑफ टूटोरियल्स आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक एवरी थिंग अबाउट सर्वलेट्स एंड जी एस पी टेक्नोलॉजी स्टेप बाई स्टेप सो बिफोर वी गेट स्टार्टेड लेट्स फर्स्ट ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड वट्स दिस टेक्नोलॉजी फॉर गेज इन आर डे टू डे लाइफ वी कम अक्रॉस टू मिलियंस एंड बिलियंस ऑफ वेबसाइट्स लाइक गूगल डॉट कॉम गॉन टू डॉट ओ आर जी अमेजॉन डॉट कॉम फ्लिपकार्ट डॉट कॉम एक्सेट्रा नो इफ यू आर ए डेवलपर एंड यू वॉन्ट टू डेवलप अ काइंड ऑफ सिमिलर वेबसाइट वट आई जस्ट स्पेसिफाइड देन डेफिनेटली यू वुड वॉन्ट टू चेक आउट वट आर डिफरेंट लैंग्वेजेज एंड फ्रीमवर्क अवेलेबल इन द मार्केट विच यू कैन मेक यूज ऑफ टू डू सो If I go and check out market for the same, I would find out that there are hundreds of uh, such languages and frameworks available, like Java, Python, Ruby, Scala, Smalltalk, JavaScript, Django framework, ASP.NET, Zen framework, etc. So you have endless options available which you can make use of to develop stunning websites. Now, out of all these options, if you have decided that you want to make use of java programming language to develop a website then in other words you have decided to learn servlets and gsps technology let me explain what exactly i mean by this okay servlets and gsps technology allows a developer to develop a website using java programming language that's all about it it doesn't solve any other purpose other than this so if your goal is to develop a website using java then servlets and gsp is what you have to learn because there's a misconception currently i can see in the market among students and the professionals what they feel is it's no longer needed to learn servlets and gsps to develop a website using java and what they feel is it's uh, good to learn frameworks like spring framework struts framework stripes framework or you know any similar kind of framework to develop you know a website using java but they may not be 100% right and the reason is internally all these frameworks what i just mentioned make use of servlets and gsps technology only so you cannot master these framework unless and until you have mastered servlets and gsps technology itself so with all this without any further delay let's get started with servlets and gsps by first setting up our development environment which we would need to develop our first servlets application all right guys a big thank you for learning servlets and gsps technology with me if you have any feedback or any constructive comment or you want me to upload any specific topic in this series or you want me to upload altogether a new series on our channel gone to series then do post a comment below the video or write to me on this email id for all of your queries guys we upload videos on our channel gone to series almost on daily basis so if you want to get regular updates on uh, what tutorials we upload then you got to subscribe our channel do like this video if it really has proved helpful to you and i'm going to catch you in the next part of this tutorial